Okay, like I said, I had to cut it. So, this is the ending now. Wait, where do I have to go? The door's shut. <coughs> I take it the health station's useless. There's a dead guy. Am I supposed to go... Where am I supposed to go? Points to go here. Points to go here. Then points to go here. Ah, I see it now. This is Big Daddy's top speed. Ah, uh, look out, those are bombs. It'll take you up. Hold on. Desperately hold to the thing. And then, Father. The rapture dream was over. You taught me that evil is just a word. Under the skin, it's simple pain. For you, mercy was victory. You sacrificed, you endured, and when given the chance, you forgave. Always. Mother believed this world was irredeemable, but she was wrong, father. We are Utopia, you and I, and in forgiving, we left the door open for her. Aha! So she had something to learn from me. The rapture dream is over, but in waking, I am reborn. This world is not ready for me, yet here I am. It would be so easy to misjudge them. You are my conscience, father, and I need you to guide me. Uh-oh. Rusty old diving suit. You will always be with me now, Father. Your memories, your drives. And when I need you, you'll be there on my shoulder, whispering. And I rescued them all. If Utopia is not a place, but a people, then we must choose carefully, for the world is about to change. And in our story, Rapture was just the beginning. 
Uh, it's too bad that 2K went away right after the next one. Kind of wasn't that good that 2K is no longer exists because there's no sequels. There's only one more, and that's a prequel. Right, so the next one is Bioshock Infinite, Sky Racists, and the World of Yesteryear. Additional support. Well, that's the last one on this disc. The next infinite's on its own disc. Seemed pretty good. That last part really... I'm wondering how that last part was so long. Wow. It's a pretty good game. It seems like they did a good job remastering it with the exception of the glitches and the crashes. It's crashed at least twice on me. Hard crashed out to the system menu. I don't know if that's the PlayStation 4 or the fact that it just crashes. At least there was no permanently sealed doors like the last one. Right, here we are at the credits. <clears throat> After rescuing a whole new set of... of, uh... little sisters. And if you're waiting for Fallout to come out, unfortunately that's going to lag behind a little bit because of the... I haven't had time to record a third set. <laughs> the only thing I really have left is the vault there. I really wanted to get through this. I really wanted to play this. And then I got Skyrim Special Edition. with Snowball the Dragon Cat. Hmm. All in all, a fun experience to play this game. I think it's worth getting the remaster if you're not if you haven't played it before I don't know if it's really worth rebuying if you've already played it though I guess that'd be up to you if you want to see a little bit better graphics not like super better but because it's an older game dun, 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 dun. this music is so loud I wonder if YouTube's gonna mark it because of this music. I'm always worried about that, but it didn't mark the last credits. They didn't give me trouble with the last Bioshock's credits. Of course, I turned down all the in game music because. For some reason, they hate that. So if you're just playing this on your own, you can just have the music up and it gives it more of an atmosphere. For complete music credits, check Bioshock2Game.com slash music. 
uses blink video technology. <laughs> Weird thank you notes. Thanks to the Lamb family. Well, I guess in the end I even saved her. The the jerk that kept trying to kill me and actually originally succeeded killing me. I'm playing this character that's that shot in the head in the beginning and actually came around and forgave everyone and let most of them live. I was a little bit worried about that whole uh, spider slice, spider sl splicer uh, religious guy. Because he just outright attacked me. So it turns out he wasn't part of it. Streamline Studios production. There's a lot of 2K stuff here, but I had heard they don't exist anymore, and that this was brought this was redone by someone else who bought the rights to it or something. It's like a whole pile of logos whenever you start these games. Would it be possible to build an actual rapture? And would it be worthwhile doing? An underwater city. I think it would be possible. Everyone would have to... They, would, they wouldn't be able to... You wouldn't be able to transfer from the city to the surface as easy as in the game, though. Because of pressurization. You'd have to uh, decompress to go up and compress to go down. Ha ha ha, quality assurance. Excuse me, quality assurance. This game crashed twice. Then again, Skyrim crashes every time I use it, but I'm using mods on Skyrim. National Quality Assurance. Wow, these are some long credits. brief cutout right there would be me dropping my controller on the floor because <laughs> it's wired to my mic. I don't think the DLC has anything to do with the story, so I'm not going to bother with that. I might try it just to try it.
but I don't think it's story related. So that's Bioshock 2. See you when I get to Infinity. Have a good day. Bye bye.